another thing that's really making URL defenses difficult is that hackers know that their sites are much more likely to be uh, visited if they're on a trusted domain, right? Mm. So if I just stand up some from some new web server, it's, it's likely that uh, you know a reputation-based system might find that suspicious. But you know ones that only look at the domain level uh, for a site like Bitly, uh, which is a very common URL shortener, right? Yeah. It, it can obscure like what's what's behind that URL and make it very difficult. And, and so we actually see a lot of uh, exploitation of these types of services. 25% of all URLs that we find that are malicious are hosted on a good domain. You know, we spend a lot of time using and talking about HTTPS as a more secure method and you know, to look at that address bar and make sure it has a little lock, yeah. right? And so people expect to see that and be like, oh yeah, I'm on the right site. Uh, and so fishers know that as well. And today we see roughly about a third of all phishing sites are hosted on HTTPS. Mm -hmm.